everyone! Welcome to Vlogtober Part 2. Happy Saturday everyone! As you can see, I got ready today, which is very rare for me. So, I put on an outfit, did my makeup, did my hair, feeling very cute. Why am I dressed, you may ask? Well, my mom's best friend is having a get-together today, so we stayed in contact with her. Uh, we've known her since like, I don't know, 97 maybe? So that is a long time. I was only like four years old and she has a daughter my age and we've been like best friends since. We haven't kept in contact too much. Um, I last talked to her last year and I'm gonna see her today so that's fun. I haven't seen her since 2005 but I've seen my mom's best friend a couple of times now. They were uh, co-teachers together. That's how my mom met her. She was a teacher here and um, her mom was a teacher so we were her, their students and it was really fun. So she invited me last night last minute so me and my dad are heading there so I can show you my outfit. We are again going to ignore my messy bed because I got ready real quick today so yeah it came priority to get ready instead of fixing my bed you should see the bathroom right now it has my curling iron and a lot of makeup scattered everywhere but here is my outfit it's complete I forgot my bag I just packed it it's out in the living room but yeah headband is from Amazon bodysuit is from Shein my necklace is Amazon and my belt is ASOS, my jeans are Target, sandals are Walmart. I'll link my outfit details, but that is what I'm wearing. I'm not really sure with the belt. I don't really wear belts too often, but I have my rings on, on both hands, some bracelets, and I did my makeup. So yeah, and I also curled my hair with the T3 curling wand, and I'm getting very good at it because that is amazing. And here is the bag that I'm taking with me. Pretty much, as I said, I'm going neutral a lot. So that is my outfit of the day. And I'm just waiting for someone in the family of theirs to pick us up. Hello, I am back home from the get together that I went to earlier that I was talking about. It was fun, I got to hug all of my old friends and it was just such a good time. I haven't seen them since 2005, I believe. So yeah, we were what, 13? 12, 13 around that time. Had a great day. I'm going to go take my makeup off now and put my hair up, put on some cozy pajamas. And I think I'm going to read another witchy book on my iPad and call it an evening. So that was my day. I'll see you whenever I pick up the camera. Hello everyone, happy Monday. So I'm ready again. That is the first that I got in ready almost two days in a row, Saturday and Monday. But I need to film some content, take some pictures. So I had to get ready. I woke up a little bit earlier to do that. So yeah, I guess I can show you a mini OOTD. I'm going to shoot this look outside my apartment because I don't have anywhere to shoot pictures here in Oxnard, but I tried my best. So here is my outfit. That is what it looks like. Oops, the camera strap fell. But yeah, I don't have my boots on yet. I'm gonna wear a hat and yeah, I'm not sure if I like this kind of skirt. I wanted to try something different and I think I like the other style skirts better, but I'm just going to shoot pictures <laughs> in it. And yeah, this probably will be up Friday on my blog. So yeah, I'll link the details down below though and it's probably already up by the time you watch this vlog. I also did my nails again. I put on my press-ons on Friday evening before I went to that party and it's kind of like nude nails. I probably should have painted over it but I kind of like like the nude look of them. So I've been calling this my no makeup makeup look nails <laughs> because you know the no makeup when you have no makeup on but you have makeup on and it's barely there. That is I guess what do you call this? No 
no nail nail look <laughs> so thought that was cute i think i did a good job with them they look really good and i pushed my cuticle back so they actually look like my real nails especially with the color so i'm enjoying my no nail nail look <laughs> here is my full ootd with the boots my bag and my hat I feel like a proper fashion blogger. I wish I could wear this to like a pumpkin patch or somewhere fall because that would be so cute but I don't really have fall next to me. Plus I don't have a car right now so <laughs> that's another problem. But yeah, here is my look and I'm gonna go shoot this outside. Just got done with filming my video for Friday. There's all my books on the floor that I just film, have to clean that up later. Here's my setup. I had the monitor attached to it with the cord and this was my makeshift tripod. <laughs> Ain't that fun? So yeah, I'm going to cook dinner now. I'm going to make chicken parmesan. It's the first time I'm doing it. Hopefully it turns out okay. If it's not, I'm not going to show you, but if it turns out okay, I'll show you. So my memory card <laughs> is running out of space. So I guess I'll see you later. I'll have to transfer the footage, but yeah. That's it for now. I made my chicken parmesan spaghetti thing, whatever that's called, and then some bread. And I have my fruit punch and water while we watch TV over there. Hello, happy Friday. So I'm gonna spend my Friday night in. I'm wearing Halloween pajamas. Well, the bottom parts are. And I'm gonna build my bookshelf out into the living room. So that's gonna be a separate video, but I'll give you a sneak peek in this one. And yeah, I'm gonna go make a peanut butter jelly sandwich while I go uh, watch The Addams Family on TV out in the living room and then build my bookshelf. So those are my Friday plans. Here is my uh, OTD, what I'm wearing to build my bookshelf. Here is my peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I'm going to eat that. Saturday so I finished my bookshelves last night they're all set up they're still in the living room I have to bring them in here and decorate them I need to pull out some of the um, non holiday decorations out of there um, maybe tomorrow or the next day so I got my Halloween costume bits a few days ago but we're gonna open them together they're here in my bed and I can show you what I got and also what I'm going to be because I know this is going out after my Halloween get ready with me video and stuff like that so you'll see it first there before you see it here even though I'm filming this first. Here is the dress that I got last month so this is going to be like the basis of the outfit have to open that up and here's all the packages we have one two and three. Still got my handy dandy pink cutting knife to open all these up. So let me open it up and show you. So first off, I got a white eyeliner. So let me swatch it and see how good it is. I got it at Shein for like two bucks. So let me try it if I can balance it in my hand. Well, that is what the tip looks like and that is what the color looks like. I wanted the white eyeliner for the makeup look. So yay, my first white eyeliner. Here we have it. It's getting dark in my room. I should turn my light on. Did that make a difference? I don't know. But here we have all the costume accessories. So I got some fishnet tights, some long gloves, the hat, and then a wig for once. So I don't know. Can you tell by this what I'm going to be? Please let me know. But I'm going to tell you I'm going to be Cruella de Vil. <laughs> So I got the black and white wig, a dress, and then the long gloves, and hopefully it will all come together. Ta-da! So I got the black and white feather boa. I got it off of Walmart for like five bucks. The one at Party City was $20. I mean, it was much thicker, but I'm just going to use it once. So yeah, that's my Halloween costume details. I'm so excited. I got the white eyeliner because I wanted to do a wing liner and then black polka dots so I can have like Dalmatian liner. I thought that would be cute. So yeah, that is my 
costume details. So I'm down here on the floor because we're gonna open more packages. I got my Ulta order in. So I shopped the beauty fall beauty haul sale uh, the first of the month and I got that in like two days later, just never opened it. And I also ordered from their big hair fall event. So I got that in a few days ago. So I've been wanting these. So let me just show you and open it up. Two boxes. This is from the fall haul sale. And then this is just from the hair care sale that they just had. Kind of sad. I wanted to order one more thing from the hair event sale. But it sold out when I woke up. So that meant it wasn't meant to be. I wasn't meant to have it. So I'm just going to take it. As that, I was going to save it for a Christmas present for myself and open it up on Christmas. But it sold out, so there's probably something better out there for me. I'm just going to take it as a sign that I didn't need it. So, to make me happier, I'm just going to open my Ulta order anyways and use those products. First thing out of this box is this Kiss Falscara uh, set. I really wanted to try it. I'm so excited too. My lashes aren't the greatest, so... Maybe I'll do a video of this, like a first impressions of me trying it. So that's the first thing that I got. Next up we have, oh, the remover. So I got the remover to the Falscara set just in case I don't like it. I can easily remove it. So pick that up and I forgot to tell you the prices. So this was originally like 24 bucks, I believe. And I got it on sale for like half that. And this was only like four bucks, so really good deal that's why i picked it up during the sale so let's see what else we have in here next up in here we have the elf jelly pop watermelon glittery face mask i thought this was so cute when i saw it online and i wanted to treat myself to a glittery face mask and do like a proper pamper night so i picked that up and this was like i don't know seven bucks i believe i don't really remember the prices it's been so long but yeah I can't wait to try it. Maybe you'll see it in one of these Vlogtober vlogs. Now we have the final one that I just got in to unbox. I love this cutter. It is so good. I would show you how it works, but my address is like right there. So I can't do that, but I'll show you what's inside. So I opened it up and it's packaged really well. So let's remove that over there. And then here is what I picked up. I got the last attachment that I wanted. This is the T3 Undone Waves attachment. So I love my T3 curling iron. I'm finally learning how to use it and it turns out great. I have the tapered wand and the huge wand. <laughs> I don't know what it's called, but I got this one to complete my collection. I mean, there's a few more, but this is the one that I wanted. I was trying to get this when it went on sale before, but it sold out really quickly. So finally, I got to pick that up and I'm excited to curl my hair with this one because maybe this will be great for my hair type. So here is my mini Ulta haul. So that is what I picked up. And a few, uh, got a few items. Really excited to try the curling wand attachment out. And this is just going to be a backup. This is always sold out at my Ulta near me. So I decided since it was on sale just to pick up another one. So yeah, and then can't wait to try this out. And maybe I'll do this after a pamper day. Maybe tomorrow on a Sunday, that sounds fun. So yeah, that is everything from my Ulta haul. I also did some Insta stories. That's why it took me forever to do this haul that it is dark out now. So yeah, that is my day so far. I think my dad and I are gonna go out for a walk. I'm gonna put on a sweater and some sneakers and we're just gonna walk around the apartment complex. We do that every evening. Why does the sky seem purple tonight? In real life, it's like a grayish pink, but on camera, it's a purple. I don't know. Oh, that's pretty. So I really need to get like a proper filming area. I'm going to put my bookshelves around this wall right here. Um, probably going to do that tomorrow or film my Halloween get ready with me. That means I'll have to shower and all that to prepare for that. But yeah. I am going to go for a walk now and then I don't know if I'm going to 
vlog anything else tonight. Maybe if we watch Hocus Pocus. I really want to watch that. Everyone raves about that movie and I don't think I've seen it. Maybe I have, I just don't remember it. Um, but I haven't watched it in so long if I did watch it as a kid. I was more of a Halloween town kind of girl. So yeah, I should watch that too. I love Halloween town. I watched it last year with my dad and he was quite a fan of it. So yeah, I guess I'll see you again later or the next time we pick up this camera. Man, I'm glowy from this ring line. <laughs> Hello everyone, happy Tuesday. I just got home from a breast cancer awareness party event that one of my mom's friends took us to. So I didn't get a chance to vlog earlier and I couldn't vlog at the event, but I took a lot of pictures so I can insert those now. <laughs> And those balloons that you see in the pictures, I brought some home. I won a cup in the raffle and we got a t-shirt and my dad got a book thing. He won that in a raffle. So yeah, me and my dad match too. <laughs> Here's our picture together if you wanted to see that. He doesn't normally wear pink, so I forced him to wear pink today. So yeah, I'm still dressed. I need to shoot a TikTok video, so... I'm gonna use my ring light. That's why I turned this light on. I'm going to shoot it out in the living room. I'm not in my bedroom for once. So yeah, I'm gonna take this off because this is a very thick teddy bear coat. But yeah, that was my evening. Now let me film a TikTok. Oh look, it's you. <laughs> so even though I ate at the event, I only ate a little bit. So I actually made dinner. So French fries and then a chicken sandwich with cheese and then I stole some of my dad's root beer so yeah that's what we're having for dinner taking a break from filming my video to have some snacks I got this at food for less the other day there are five bucks but it's so cute they have like a ghost I named him Mr. Boo and then we have a pumpkin <laughs> haven't named that yet and then this like hand thing so I thought it was cute it looked like he was coming out of like a graveyard <laughs> at one point but I messed up the illusion after eating all the brownie bites but I thought it was super cute for Halloween. This is what it looks like on. It's so cute. I love that it actually kind of fits almost so yeah that's so cute. So it's the end of the night and I am tired from doing my try on haul. Who knew that was so much work? <laughs> I tried on so many outfits for a TikTok also the video for friday hopefully i can get that done it's already edited i just need to edit in the overlay shots now but that is some exhausting work but i put my hair up i'm gonna go take my makeup off and just lounge in bed because we have a big day tomorrow i have to go clean out my storage here that's like 10 minutes away and then the first of the month we're hopefully gonna go to our other storage to get some of our other furniture so that's our plan. I'll see you whenever I pick up this camera. I don't know if I'm filming tomorrow, but we'll see. Hello everyone. As you can see, I'm in my Halloween costume, but it's only October 30th because I had to film my Halloween get ready with me. You know, I do it every year. So here's my costume. I only have one love on so I can use my phone and camera and all that, but I have the left one on. And I have the wig on. This is my first time wearing a like costume wig. I think it turned out okay. I just have my hair like in a bun. You can't see in the back of my <laughs> head. And then my outfit. I just took some pictures outside <laughs> my front door. It's dark outside already but you can still like see me because there's like light right there. I put my fall wreath right there for the video because it doesn't fit on my door. I bought a huge... Um, hanger that it doesn't fit on my front door so bedroom door it is but I think it's so cute and I'm wearing tights and uh, boots right now you'll see in the Halloween get ready with me video it's probably already up before this one because I need to edit it tonight so it can go up tomorrow on Halloween so yeah I didn't do my eyeliner too good do not recommend the Shein uh, white eyeliner it just goes on very patchy and <laughs> I don't think I did a good job. I wanted to do like Dalmatian eyes with like the liner, 
but that didn't pan out so I used white eyeshadow as a base and then just uh, black eyeliner dots all over my eyes but the rest of my makeup turned out good and the hair <laughs> and the costume but not the eye look. I also bought some candy yesterday to give out to all the trick-or-treaters if they come. If not, I have a lot of candy that I have no idea what I'm gonna do with. I'll show you the little pumpkin thing but yeah. <laughs> I feel so weird dressed up a day early. I have to do this all again tomorrow. So let me show you the candy though. Here is the cute little pumpkin thing I bought yesterday. They didn't have the traditional orange one. I need to buy one next year. I keep forgetting to, but I don't go trick or treating anymore. So yeah, I put on the stickers by itself and the stickers say adult supervision required <laughs> to put it on. So I'm gonna keep it. I think it's cute. So, I have the candy all ready for the trick-or-treaters tomorrow, if any come. And I have my costume all ready. What am I going to do? Probably just give away candy. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm going to go. I'm going to take some of these accessories off so I can edit the pictures and the videos. But I wanted to vlog <laughs> my cute costume because I'm really proud of it. And I love that I'm Cruella de Vil this year. I should have bought like a cute Dalmatian toy, but I couldn't find one in the nick of time, so oh well. Yeah, I'll see you again later, I guess. Well, it's a little while later and I'm just sat in bed watching Harry Ween. <laughs> at least I'm in costume. I feel like I'm a hair, um, I feel like I'm at a Harry Styles concert, all dressed up in my bedroom, so I've been looking that on my phone. I'm still in costume. <laughs> I haven't actually taken it off. I'm actually like really excited to wear this and I love the wig even though it's a tad bit itchy I'm enjoying myself right now <laughs> so yeah that is what I've been up to I'm probably gonna put on some Halloween pajamas now so I feel better and I need to wear this again tomorrow anyways so yeah happy Halloween everyone <laughs> As you can see, I put my costume on from yesterday, just put the wig on, did my makeup, and I'm wearing the dress. Um, I don't know if I'm actually going to go out <laughs> wearing this because there's nothing to do around here. Um, I'm going to wait for some trick-or-treaters though, but me and my dad are going to go for our nightly walk. So I might just take the wig off and just wear what I'm wearing <laughs> and we'll bring the bucket of candy to see if we find anyone to we'll see if we'll find any little kids who want candy if they're out and about so yeah that is my Halloween plan so far I don't know why I put on makeup and the costume again but I wanted to be in the Halloween spirit a little bit back from my walk now I decided to put the wig on because when am I going to wear this again? So I should take advantage of it. So I'm probably just going to stay here in my room and wait for some trick-or-treaters. We did see a few kids and we gave out a few of the candies that I have in that little like pumpkin container. So that was fun. They were like just little cute kids and I love their costumes. So my dad and I gave out some candy on our walk. We only came across, I think, two kids. <laughs> and then when we were coming to the door, we saw a few older kids uh, standing there. So we asked if they were trick-or-treating and they said, yeah, and we gave them candy too. So at least I gave out a few candies. You never know, we might be able to give out more. I don't know where all the kids are at, but I'm here waiting for them. So, I have my phone here. I'm probably gonna find a live stream of Harry Styles' concert tonight because I want to see what he's wearing for night two. I love the Dorothy costume yesterday. I loved his blush and everything. So that was fun. I'm excited to see what he's going to be tonight. So I'm gonna go on my phone and find a live stream. Hoping he sings a few other songs tonight. I don't know if he will, but yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I've been obsessed with him at the moment. My favorite song probably has to be To Be So Lonely. I don't know why, but I've just been singing that all month long, it seems like. So, hope he sings that tonight. He sang it last night. So hopefully he sings it again this night. So, yeah. Probably just going to be on my phone and see if I can find a live stream or just something and see if I can watch that.
So I just got done watching Harry Ween. <laughs> that was fun. I took off my wig. It was very annoying. But I'm gonna eat some candy. <laughs> There's not many trick-or-treaters. As I said earlier, we gave out some candy on a walk, but now one's come to the door. So I'm gonna have an M&M and a Twix. I just ordered pizza. So yeah, I'm gonna go back out into the living room and maybe watch a Halloween movie or Cruella de Vil. <laughs> Remember last year when I was Scooby-Doo, I watched Scooby-Doo. Probably I'm gonna watch Cruella tonight. Yay, we got pizza. So I just got cheese pizza. And then the bottom one is probably pepperoni. And then we have pepperoni. It has extra pepperoni, I think. So, yay. Here's my current setup. I'm editing Vlogtober part two. This vlog you're watching. Um, my iPhone is full, so I'm transferring the videos onto a USB memory stick. And then I need to edit a blog post for tomorrow on the other laptop. So it's the end of the night and Vlogtober is almost over. So yeah, I spent my Halloween doing nothing pretty much. I dressed in my costume, watched a Harry Styles concert, which I then proceeded to watch again while I was writing blog posts and editing the first half of this vlog. So sadly, no more trick-or-treaters ever came to the house. So now I have so much candy. My dad loves candy though, so he's already tucked into it and ate so many of it. I had another Reese's and Twix, but that's it. So I think I had four pieces of candy total, which is crazy because you would think I would eat more, but I didn't. I got done with my blog post for the week, and I think I planned out most of November's content, which is interesting that I'm so ahead of schedule. So that is another thing that I spent doing this evening. I really wish I could have gotten my reaction to some of the songs Harry played. He played Medicine, which I started freaking out about. I'm surprised my dad didn't come in here and ask what was going on because I was freaking out uh, when that came on. And then, yeah, I just enjoyed the show while I was working on all my other bits that I had to do. And also, speaking of blog bits, a very exciting purchase, which you will see soon. <laughs> I don't want to jinx it, but I'm very excited about it and you'll see a video about what I'm talking about in the future. So can't wait for that. Also, I cannot wait for Vlogmas now that Vlogtober is over. Am I going to do every day it in? I don't know. Who knows? Stay tuned. So I'm going to quit babbling. I need to take my makeup off and wash my hair because my makeup looks terrible because it's like hours later and then after I get done with my shower I'm going to read here in bed with my fairy lights. I'm gonna read this book right here so yeah I'm all ready for that. I'm in my Halloween pajamas which I'm gonna change into more Halloween pajamas after my shower. And I probably made Vlogtober part two's vlog really long, so I'm going to cut it here. I hope you enjoyed watching me throughout October of 2021. Stay tuned for more content from me. Make sure you're subscribed because I'm so excited for November and December because there's going to be so much going on. And yeah, I'm just going to wrap up Vlogtober part two here. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye everyone. No one can do it like you. Ooh.